Hello, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to make an, a troubleshooting thing with your iPhone 15 or 15 um, Plus. If you have a problem, a problem that you have a freeze frame, it does not work anymore, or something else, the first step is make a soft reset. That means volume up, volume down, power button until you see the Apple trend, branding. This the reboot will make a solution in 90% of all problems. Then the next step is um, if you can go to restore the device by using um, the app uh, itself. But if your device has no function anymore, the only way to get a um, reset of that device is the hard reset stuff with DFU mode. Direct firmware upgrade mode. How we perform this is we will need a USB C uh, to USB C or USB A cable. And this cable has to be uh, the features that it is data sync possible. So look to an expensive good cable. Do not use the cheapest one because cheaper one only can reload your battery, for example. And <laughs> if you found this, you're ready. Then you need a personal computer, for example, and iTunes updated, still running in the background. Then you go and connect your personal computer by the USB-C cable and the iPhone 15 or 15 Plus with your computer. iTunes is still running. To bring your smartphone into the DFU mode, we have to perform some steps. That means the first step is we have to reboot the system. And a reboot is a soft reboot uh, process. Volume up, volume down, power button. For approximately 10 seconds. After this, the uh, screen will be black after 10 seconds. Then the reboot is in progress. Then we add the volume down button and push this volume down button again. We does not need after 10 seconds to push the power button anymore. And um, with the with the uh, with the, 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 the volume down button, we can perform this. Okay, again, first step is volume up, volume down, power button. Keep holding approximately 10 seconds. If the screen is black, okay, we are uh, remove our fingers from the right side and then we go to the left side and push the volume down button but don't forget on the right side there is a power button too these two buttons we have to push for approximately five seconds after this five seconds we can remove the power button again and keep holding the minus button okay <laughs> that's easy isn't it oh yeah of course so okay let's perform this we um, enter into the device by using um, USB-C to USB uh, connection via our computer system. And then volume up, volume down, power button. Keep pushing until the black is sc uh, the, the screen will be black, approximately 10 seconds. Then remove and begin power button and volume down button for approximately five seconds. After the five seconds, I remove my fingers from the right side, sec, and now keep holding on the volume down button on the left side until um, the DFU mode is seen. We're setting up Apple uh, device that was shown in the right uh, corner of our device. Here we are, Apple device is set up and ready to go, device is ready. So we are now in the view mode information. If you are in that mode, that means you cannot control anymore something uh, with your smartphone. This is the DFU mode. You can go from uh, iTunes, for example, or other um, applications and bring with the USB-C cable connection with your computer new iOS data. That means you can root your system or something um, with your Apple iPhone 15 or 15 um, Plus. 
and in this status, it is ready to get new data. Okay, so you can in this status of DFU, where you can do nothing with any function here, it is not broken. Okay, keep cool, everything is fine. We can remove this again. Uh, keep cool, but in this state, you can um, give new data into the phone. Okay, oh yeah, you saw it on the right side, there was a uh, DFU mode detected. To um, come out of the DFU mode, if you does not like to root it anymore, it's easy, okay, here. Wait 20 minutes, then it will automatically reboot or volume up, volume down, power button. And keep and hold this power button, keep and hold it until you see the Apple branding. Then you perform a soft reset, okay. After this soft reset, you hear it and now it is um, disabled um, from the connection. You can remove your fingers if you see the Apple branding. And um, that means we go back in standard way. To make a um, clear reset, so you have a problem with your device, um, then you can enter into the DFU mode, of course. Or if, is, uh, if this DFU mode does not fix your problem because you does not need to uh, use an external um, application for it, you can use iTunes and the um, recovery mode here to, uh, to, to, to sync that again. Okay, how we perform this? We perform volume up, volume down, power button, and now keep push and hold it. And now, yeah. while we are, are connected, we have the computer and iTunes and our Apple I, um, iPhone 15 or 15 um, Plus, we keep pushing the power button and keep pushing until we see that here on the screen, there is in um, restore mode or something else. Here we are, okay? This is the uh, mode to, um, to an update mode. It's not the DFU mode. This is the um, the restore mode, okay? The first DFU mode, wo uh, th that was to, um, to root your system, for example, to troubleshoot it in the deep with, with, uh, with special uh, software uh, and so on. And the restore mode, as shown now, is that you will detect a problem here we are, okay, you can read it there. There is a problem with our iPhone, okay? And that requires it to be updated or restored. The problem may be fixed by updating our phone, which preserves our settings and content. However, if update doesn't work, it may be necessary to click restore, which really erase all settings and content. If we backed up this iPhone to the computer or iCloud, we will prompt it to restore the backup on to the iPhone. We will need our iCloud password to find my as being enabled, of course. Okay, so the next thing is we can make cancel to cancel this thing, update to make an update or restore to restore this. Okay. We choose now restore because restore means um, we are removing everything and iTunes will get a new version of the iOS and this new version will be go onto our iPhone. Okay, so if you now restore an update, this um, update provides important bug fixes and so blah, blah, blah. And we can make this now, of course, um, software update and so on. The iPhone is in recovery mode. And now the iTunes is downloading the software for this iPhone. And after the download is completed, it will restore our iPhone when the download is completed. Okay. On computer system like Windows, as you can see here, um, it is shown not so good to you, so you does not um, know how much uh, the download will be. Here, if I go to do done, it's all gone. Wait and wait and wait. You have to wait until the Apple or iTunes perform the job and after this job, it will reboot the system and then you have a new iOS on the screen on your um, Apple iPhone and you can make a clear setup after this and then um, the software problems are solved, of course.
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Sun Sun.